we have any mail? No. But your neighbor gave this to me. Oh. I wonder if it's from Phil. <laughs> Oh no, it's an invitation to Cassidy's birthday party. My kids will be very excited, Oswald. Thank you, that was great. Well, I'm a Developing the world's most advanced humanoid robot didn't happen overnight. It took teams of Honda experts over 20 years to create this amazing piece of technology. And we're talking about experts in the fields of physics, anatomy, mathematics, computer sciences, chemistry, mechanical, and electrical engineering. Oh, and check this out. Awesome. Come this way, please. Now, if I'm sitting down, or in a wheelchair like my wife, Osimo's camera eyes are at about the same level as my eyes, and this makes communication very simple. In fact, if you take a look at the screen, you can see Osimo looking at me. Hello, Osimo. Hello, Kevin. Oh, Osimo, please turn out to all of our new friends. And everyone, wave and say, hello, Osimo. And there you are. Now, you might be wondering why Osmo isn't on wheels or treads or something like that. Well, Osmo is designed to help people. And to be a helper in our world, the world that you're about to see is one of Osmo's most challenging maneuvers, made possible by combining all of its onboard technology. The ability to climb a set of stairs with balance and precision is a combination of over two decades of research and development. Now, first, Osmo stops momentarily at the foot of the stairs and adjusts its position by reading a mark on the floor using a sensor in its torso. Oh, are you all ready, Osmo? I am ready. Okay, then. Go for it. Now, with each step, Osmo must adapt to constantly counterbalance using all its computing power to remain upright all along the way. Way to go, Osmo! Go ahead and take a look into the room and see if it's ready for my mom and dad, please. And, oh, that looks perfect. Thank you, Osimo. You're welcome. Now, if you thought going up the stairs was difficult, it takes even more balance and coordination to make it back down. Whatever we go ready, Osimo. Once again, Osimo will find its position by reading a mark on the floor using the sensor in its torso. And, when it's ready, it will descend the stairs, constantly adjusting with each step. Step in a straight line or 
on a curve. And this makes navigating through a house with all of its constantly changing obstacles very simple. And believe me, also, that move is going to come in very handy with my kids and all of their constantly changing obstacles. But what's even more impressive, not only can Osimo walk forward, but Osimo can also walk backward as well, constantly adjusting its center of gravity with each step, <laughs> just like us. And Osimo's balance is so good, you know what? Let's just show them. Osimo, please balance on one foot. Oh. Like this? Yeah! Now that's what makes it look easy. Now the other foot. Alright. Osmo must constantly analyze the data from all of its sensors and 34 separate circle motors. And, well, that's what I guess is true. There's really nothing you can't do.